So I was asked to perhaps supply a few anecdotes from the making of the film. Uh, one, a terrific group of people, and I like to take I like to take a little bit of credit for some of the casting of the film because it was my suggestion that led to the casting of Ellen and Dick Reilly. Um, a wonderful group of people. We shot out in the boonies in a little tiny log cabin, uh, and if you've seen the movie, you of course know that's pretty much where all of the action was set. Um, grand folks. One of the things I remember is that uh, we would shoot. Oh golly, it seemed like 15 pages a day, and poor, uh, poor Jesus, which is what I call him, poor Jesus would. Uh, I'm, that's probably too much of a giveaway. Spoiler alert! <laughs> spoiler alert! Anyway. Poor Jesus would have these ridiculous speeches, and the rest of us would show up, and, you know, we'd only have interjections, so we'd talk about who won the basketball game the night before, and just shoot the shit and have a high old time, and poor Jesus was sitting in the corner just buried in 15 pages of monologue. He was a, he was a heroic fellow doing that. Uh, a couple of lovely women worked on that show. I remember my wife gave me no end of grief about that when she found out I was getting rides to and from the set with uh, Annika, who went on to be presumably Mrs. Jesus for a time. Um, Annika would give me uh, give me lifts home upon occasion. Bonnie would ask me, uh, "So you get a ride home with Mrs. Jesus tonight?" Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, what other what anecdotes do I have? Let's see. Feed me some questions, Richard. Uh, well, uh, there was some controversy about food on set, as I recall. Oh, well, you know, there's always controversy about food on a low-budget set because you're trying to put every penny you can towards the making of the movie, and it's difficult. And uh, invariably, there are people who object. I just came off of a movie in Cleveland, however, where we did a lot of late-night shooting, and there was only one restaurant available to cater, Aladdin. Aladdin made Middle Eastern food, so we would have... Baba ganoush every night. Baba ganoush, baba ganoush, baba ganoush, and this sort of uh, sour chicken rice dish that that we were well sick of by the uh, end. I don't remember Man from Earth uh, coming close to that. A lot of chicken. I can always count on a lot of.